Hey folks, today's a wonderful day. Every day's a beautiful day. Oh my God, it's amazing. I love it. Yeah. Uh, can I say that my first week as a sex worker has been extremely eventful and I love it. Whoa. There's an issue about my dick size. Baby carrot dick. I have a baby dick. Okay? Baby carrot dick. Baby carrot dick. I have a baby dick. Okay? Whoa. Baby carrot dick. I have a baby dick. Okay? Baby carrot dick. I have a baby dick. Okay? Baby carrot dick. I have a baby dick. Okay? Baby carrot dick. I have a baby dick. Okay? So Twitter has been on fire. Fire. Fire about my dick size and uh, uh, this one idiot said that I had a baby carrot for a dick I have slack whoa baby carrot dick I have a baby dick okay baby carrot dick I have a baby dick okay baby carrot dick I have a baby dick okay baby carrot dick I have a baby dick okay the average penis size in the world is 4.6 to 6 inches that's the margin. That's a lot bigger than average. Whoa. Eight inch bagel, that's my type. Right? The point is, is that I baby carrot for a dick. I don't. Do I, honey? And it's not true. Right? Can take their member and it has floppage and you can swing it around. Okay? Three quarters. Five and three quarters inches. Is the man baby carrot dick? I have a baby dick, okay? Baby carrot dick, I have a baby dick, okay? Baby carrot dick, I have a baby dick, okay? Baby carrot dick, I have a baby dick, okay? Baby carrot dick, I have a baby dick, okay? Baby carrot dick, I have a baby dick, okay? Baby carrot dick, I have a baby dick, okay? Baby carrot dick, I have a baby dick, okay? But there's an issue about my dick size. Baby carrot dick. I have a baby dick. Okay? Baby carrot dick. Okay? Baby carrot dick. Okay? And it's not true. Right? Okay? Baby carrot dick. That's a cool song. That gets me every time. Shout out to Fat Fo Talk for that that last little clip. Oh, he's so talented. I will put the link to that little clip in the description after it's over. Like he makes these little tiny, sometimes they're like four minutes, but they're usually less than a minute and they're brilliant and hilarious and it's really, really funny. Anyway, guys, happy Monday. <laughs> I um, hope you guys had a great weekend. Uh, we've already celebrated. We celebrated last night. Um, we had cookout and all that stuff, all that fun stuff. So I was like, well, I don't have to work today. Might as well uh, go a little bit early because <laughs> uh, we do have a lot to get to today. Um, the first thing I wanted to show you guys was something that um, happened on Bullhorn Betty's channel. <clears throat> so... Apparently, Bullhorn Betty did yet another Friday drunk stream, and I missed it when she was doing it, but I, I watched it later, and I was like, wow, wow, she was very drunk, and that's fine, whatever, she can, she can do whatever she wants, but when you drunk stream, people are going to laugh at you. I'm just saying, like, even if it was one of my friends, I would still laugh at them, you know, so you got to get over that, so... Um, apparently she had a call-in show. Okay. And so what happened was, <laughs> what had happened was the glare calls in to the show. Let me turn the volume of that up. There we go. So he calls into her show, uh, cause she put the number out there for anyone to call. And he, I guess, put on an accent and pretended to be somebody else, you know, just gassing her up. And this is what happened. So this is the glare 
giving commentary to when he called into her drunk stream. <laughs> and this is me watching it later saying, okay, I have got to play some of this on my stream because this was absolutely hilarious. Thank you, Halafala. That is Fat Photog's channel. Thank you so much. Shout out to him. He's amazing. But yeah, this was really funny. Let me know if the sound's all right, y'all. I don't know what you're going to get. Are you going to get murdered? Are we getting murdered up in the house of Bullhorn Betty? You know, that that girl's... Now, she's got she's got a little buzz going. She's got a little buzz going. But see, <laughs> I, I, I screen recorded this because I knew she wasn't going to keep this up. <laughs> For a little minute there, after this was done, she did put it on members only, on a members only setting. Because um, she was like, I could just picture her. You know what? If you're going to troll me, I'm going to make money off of it. Blah, blah, blah. People are going to listen to me get made a fool of. I'm going to make some money. Yeah. So just a couple of comments about that, Betty. <laughs> like all of the stuff that you put on members only, you get terrible numbers for. So I just want to let you know that when you do that, you lose a lot of views doing that, by the way. Thank you, Christina81. Welcome to the Dumpster Fire. I think there was somebody earlier, uh, a Heather, I uh, don't remember the last name, but thank you, Heather, for becoming a member also. I appreciate that. But, but, uh, then she took it down and she just made it private. But, I, and I don't, like I said, I'm, I don't really review her or cover her anymore. Um, I'll leave that up to Toast and whoever else uh, and all the great, <laughs> All, all the great clip channels um but this <laughs> this i wasn't not going to put in the archives folks <laughs> welcome night. mistaken reaper see that night? welcome mistaken reaper i appreciate that welcome to the dumpster fire it was a little scary on that that, thumb, that thumbnail <laughs> somebody's calling it's bullhorn betty how you doing baby Oh boy. Oh my god, am I on with Bullhorn Betty right now? <laughs> you are on the phone with Bullhorn Betty. Who oh, is this? Oh my hey, listen, long time listener, first time caller, but oh my god. Are you serious? We got security oh in the house, god. guys. I've been, I've oh been waiting to talk to you for my years. God. You, got no idea. <laughs> you got no idea, Bullhorn Betty. How are you doing tonight? I'm doing amazing. Who oh, am I you're making her blush. This is amazing. Speaking to you, you're like making my heart kind of just jump out of my chest. Wow. You're okay. <laughs> As uh, now, <laughs> I would be remiss if I did not point out that it doesn't take much, does it, Betty? Wow. Wow. I mean, you right. <laughs> I really, really, I mean, dude. Why would she call? Why would anyone call into Bullhorn Betty? She'll have your number. I totally agree. I think he was using a Google number. I hope I hope that he was because I did I did not see this until after this was already done. So Glare, I hope that you used a Google number. Otherwise, she's got your number now. Uh so females can't be security. You caught that too, huh? Yeah, she's got a lot of um very interesting views about men and women. And uh, they kind of come out sometimes. Yeah. It, it, you thought that was interesting, huh? Mm -hmm. Thank you, Rotten Route member for five months. I appreciate that. Dating sites, they work. They work. You know what I mean? There's no shame in it these days. There's no shame in the dating sites these days. I promise you, everybody does it. I'm on dating sites on the apps. I'm doing that. I mean, I never act on it. I'm just too, I don't know. Like, not anymore. <laughs> not anymore. I'm just like, eh. Do I really want to meet that person? Not really. <laughs> I just leave it alone. But Betty, Betty, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Up in my heart's jumping. My heart's jumping. Oh my God. I can't even believe I'm talking to you right wow. now. Everything you did with the with the Gabby Petito thing and 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 you was just there for the oh my God. I can't even believe I'm finally talking to you. I'm waving myself. I'm getting too hot up in this house. Ew, 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 ew. She reminds me a lot of Shani with this. With Shani, too, like, the slightest compliment, and it's like she loves you to death. 
And that's all you really have to do is give them a compliment. And she's passing out wrenches and saying, oh, you're so amazing. And it's just, you don't know these people <laughs> at all. It's just that they happen to kiss her ass. So all of a sudden now they're best friends. But thank you, uh, Liz, for the super sticker. I appreciate that. Um, Lori girl 63. Thank you for being members for five months. Love that you're on tonight. Thank you. I appreciate that. How long till we salute her discord to the level of, Oh, <clears throat> I'm sorry. How long till we saturate her discord to the level of Shani and Rev Bullhorn Betty is prime for a disaster. I don't, I don't even know if she's on discord to be honest with you. I have no idea. She seems to have a very, um, weird view of discord. I don't think that she quite grasps what it is. Uh, there was a day where she was talking about it as if it was some like evil, uh, you know, site for criminals. And I was like, you know, that it's just a social media platform, just like YouTube, just like Twitter and everything else. So I don't think that she really understands what it is. What, what is that? Betty. Betty. It's, it's me that's <laughs> Are you kidding it's me. I mean, I don't mean it like that. I don't mean it like that. I don't want to be you, you know, I'm a single woman. I'm just no joking. Way, in no way. You weren't joking. Yikes. To you, Bullhorn Betty. Oh, my God. You are the queen. <laughs> <laughs> You're making my heart just go. <laughs> I, I, oh, my God. So, I, let I, me I, ask you. Let me ask you, Mr. Now, the, for those of you, okay, trolling 101, folks, okay? <laughs> the trick, the secret it's not even a secret. The, the 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 key to a good troll, know the subject you're trolling. Know them. <laughs> know them better than they know themselves. Take advantage of their lack of self-awareness mm. and their ego. Caller, are you single? Am I single? Yikes. Well, I, I mean, between everybody here, you know, listening and everything, I am. <laughs> What cheers? Oh, she's drinking you know a screwdriver. I mean? You know what I mean. Wow. Okay. I mean, you know. We, we, I don't we, know. We, I'm a prude. By the way, I thought she didn't drink, guys. <laughs> Remember the whole thing where she was like, I only drink water and coffee. And then uh, one of the, actually one of the videos that she false copyright struck was the video of me proving that she does drink. And it wasn't even the point that she drinks. I don't care if she drinks or not, but it was the fact that she was lying about it and saying that she never drinks. And then there was all of this evidence of her drinking and then her on camera freaking out that they didn't have enough liquor to last her for the month or the week that they were in Tennessee, right? And so that was the whole point of that video. And she she absolutely tried to take that down because she didn't want anyone to know she's drinking. And then here she is drinking a screwdriver on YouTube. So I just wanted to point that out. I'm a prude. I'm a prude. I, I don't know what you mean. No, you're not. It. You know, us girls in here are getting a little hot up in the. Oh, uh, look, I got her 10 bucks. Room, I got her a 989 super oh, chat. Look God. at that. I, 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 you're welcome, baby. I'm just trying to listen. I don't mean to be that guy. You know what I mean? I don't mean to be that guy. I'm just, I, you know, it, I don't want to be smooth and everything with you and everything. I just don't know how to do it. I don't know how to I'm be smooth with Betty. Okay, that that accent, mm, that was on point. Man, you, wow. She didn't even recognize your voice. That's amazing. Missing in life, member for six months. Thank you so much. I want to be smooth with Betty. You were there. Oh, you were there. I'm, I'm dying here. I'm dying here. Screaming and yelling. Oh, my God. <laughs> I got to tell you, I don't know who you are, but I already love you already. I already love you. Already. See, I told I you. Loves me. There's no way that y'all heard it. Me he loves me. You. you have no idea how much I love you. <laughs> you know, I got pictures of you. You're not a stalker, are you? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, what? She, she, she's like hoping I'm a stalker. Listen, That's the weird shit, dude. Because somebody. Listen, when somebody, this is. I, I was, it was really hard to keep this troll going because like I was learning so much about her as I was trolling her. It's a really weird experience. Totally different from just listening, I promise. And I'm sitting there and I'm thinking, wow, she wants me to stalk her. Like oh. she actually 
would be flattered at the idea of someone stalking her, which is really fucked up and dangerous. Wow. And I really never even considered that level of 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 where her dangerous antics can go. Does that make Okay, so this is the first time I'm listening to this, by the way. So these, this is a real reaction. I'm disturbed. Makes sense. Sorry, I'm, I'm having a hard time wording this, but, but I mean, her. I mean, it could so backfire on her in such a negative way, and I do not want that to happen. I really hope that doesn't happen. And yet, subconsciously, she welcomes this. It's really fucked up. Hangs up a picture of a celebrity that makes him a stalker. That automatically makes them a stop. No, of course. I mean, if you call me a celebrity, All you're probably my biggest fan. I mean, I can handle this. Yeah, I, I had much. I had to downplay the stalker thing because I realized it was just kind of fucked up. You know what I mean? I, I, she was she was into it, dude. Like she's fucking lit up right now, like turned on. It's wow. so fucking weird. You know what's also weird is that she's the one always accusing everybody of stalking her. Like she's accusing me right now of stalking her. She thinks that if you review her and you give commentary to one of her streams, that equates to actual stalking. She's accused multiple other creators of stalking her as well. And all they did was review her content or like clip her on a channel. Like it's, it's insanity to me that she is acting like she's scared for her life and trying to sue everybody for supposedly stalking her. And yet she's weirdly turned on by it. Like I'm, I'm speechless right now. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Right. I'm Come on now. Come on now. Is this our shell? Is our shell hitting on me? What? Ew. What? Who? Hello, who are you? What? I'm just, I'm just joking. I didn't know what to do with that. She stumped me. <laughs> like it, you got me so blushing, my cheeks hurt at this point. I'm just up here trying to tell you how much I like you and everything. And I think you I think you're doing great, great things. Okay. I think you're doing great, great things. Now at this point, I'm trying to butter her up because I'm really trying to ease into I'm really, and there's just no way to do it. I realized, well, maybe, maybe I just wasn't good enough, but I was trying to ease into like really getting her to say, admit fucked up shit. And um, <laughs> I, 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 oh my goodness. As soon as, she, like, as soon as I bring the stuff up, she gets really defensive. Like she turns hateful, folks. Like it's crazy. Watch, watch, watch. Uh, how are you a stalker when she does the same thing by commenting on other people's videos? Oh, great question. Uh, because there's there's clearly a double standard going on. She does it and she calls it work. She calls it researching. She calls it journalism. When other people do it, she calls it stalking. That's why everybody's laughing at her idea that she's going to actually sue people for this. I mean, it, it's really ridiculous. If there was something wrong with my channel, then YouTube would give me a community guideline strike. But they have re reviewed my channel multiple times and is telling people and telling me there's nothing wrong. So she she can kick rocks. Like all that stuff you're doing with the school board and everything. I've been, man, I've been watching you. I'm like, like man, that, that lady, she's got, she's got cajones. That lady's got cajones. Cajones. So let me ask you. So everybody is, everybody's very interested in me. You're a very exciting wow. guy tonight. So, and I'm, I'm watching, I'm watching my ch exciting y'all chat. Um, so may I ask who you are and where you're calling from? Oh, ma'am, this is called, this is called. She already wants my personal information. She, 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 can't help she already wants to know who I am. I got to find this dude. I got to know who he is because <laughs> if he's for real, he's mine. Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> Jack Daniels and male dominance. Okay, that's what this is called. You understand? This is half of that was true because there was Jack Daniels involved. I did not feel what's up, the glare. Uh, masculine. According to Bullhorn Betty's uh, logic, I am stalking you right now, so be aware. Masculinely dominant. Sue me. <laughs> I just felt <laughs> dominant, <laughs> intellectually dominant. This is what we do. Okay, this is what we do. All right. I am from Florida. 
uh, from the center. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, Al, I did this very purposely. <laughs> I knew I could almost quote her verbatim before she even said anything. <laughs> oh the reason why I said that I lived in Florida. Oh, this is amazing. Here she is acting like her show is a fucking dating site. <laughs> <laughs> You're from where? The central part of Florida. You do, do, do you, you do know that I am also a, a resident of the beautiful state of Florida. Get out of town. I know you've been to Florida. Oh no, Betty. Are you doxing yourself right now? Oh no. No. What, you went, born no, wait, and you raised. My backyard. You are not in my backyard, girl. Born and raised. I was born in Mansion Memorial Hospital, been in Florida, the state of Florida my whole entire life. I have traveled the roads of the east coast of Florida and actually went over to central Florida, Orlando. I have made now we get the fucking biography. Awesome. <laughs> many debuts with my bullhorn. Oh my god. Holy with her bullhorn. Wait, 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 wait. She is trying to impress a guy, and the first thing she says is, hey, guys, huh? hey, baby, I use my bullhorn all over the streets of Florida. Wow, that's a weird flex. That's a very weird flex. I know, I know that these channels do something with money or whatever, but I'm, I'm going to stop myself because I don't want to give no cuss words, all right? I live around a lot of churches, okay? A lot of churches, and I don't want nobody to, you know, because we, we all around here listen to you. All of us around here listen to you. So people are actually so coming so out, they're assuming this, because you're so excited I, about Bullhorn Betty, they're actually so begging you as blank Sunday screen. afternoon, okay? Because I go in there oh Sunday morning, God, early Betty. Sunday morning. I come out of there late Sunday <laughs> afternoon, and always- I go in early. Sunday morning and come out of church late Sunday afternoon. <laughs> Every Sunday, y'all, which I don't. And no disrespect to church goers here. It was just it works for the character I was I was, you know, kind of making up as I was going along here. But oh, uh, wow. you know, it, it just worked for that. We talk about his Betty at the potluck. Oh, we talk about his Betty. Now you're going overboard. <laughs> so tell me, what's your favorite hymn? My, my favorite what? Your my favorite hymn? I mean, your church? My favorite hymn, y'all. She wants to know my favorite hymn. She's setting wow. up, folks, for something glorious. Guy, you just oh, talked no. about church, and now you guys are all talking about Boohorn Betty after church. You're raising the roof with Boohorn Betty. Oh, so what's your favorite well, hymn? Yeah. What's your favorite hymn? I really hate when she code switches like that. It's so obvious. My favorite hymn that we sing at church is. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Like she stumped me here because I I couldn't. <laughs> maybe it was the whiskey, but I couldn't <laughs> think of. A hymn that I, I mean, I know plenty of hymns because I, I used to go to church. I went through a phase, you know what I mean? And I used to go to this Pentecostal church, actually. And I was really trying to think of one and I couldn't. And I didn't think that, I mean, it didn't hit me what she was actually doing here, which was setting something up. Testing you? Maybe? See. Uh, let's see. Let me think of the one. Let me think of the one that I was trying to think of the one that came up that last time you your subject came up. I think I think toaster oven's got it pegged. No. no great. Oh no, dear no, God. You had some special trigger warning. We were talking about we were talking about the mount we were singing about the mountain of Zion, but we oh have three God. songs that we sing about that the mountain of Zion. Same. She didn't no. give a fuck of anything that I was saying. She did not give a fuck of anything that I was saying. She just wanted to sing. Oh my gosh, drunk <laughs> Betty singing. I'm sitting there trying to talk to get her to stop. <laughs> rich like me. No, no, no. I once was lost. That's a fucking sheriff, y'all. Oh god. But now I'm clown. Okay. She's Rose almost to the end. Line. Please make her stop. But now I see. Oh, that was like the Holy Ghost just <laughs> just took <laughs> my ears over. That. that was what that was like.
Like I, I, I was, I was actually tired of that song, and <laughs> the Holy Ghost just took that. It, it just took my ears over. Wow! Because it was a new instrument. You're putting a battery right in her back. <laughs> I was singing that. Oh, I'm going to hell, man. <laughs> Nobody knows until they know. Wow! 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 I hope everybody in the chat is right now raising your hands. <laughs> And praising the Lord <laughs> that Bullhorn Betty is out there doing what she does. No, people are I, raising their hands to tell her to shut the fuck up. I, st- I want to I know who you are. I'm going to unmask you, mother. Hmm. Oh, hmm. wow. Hmm. Wow. Okay. Thank well, you. That's creepy. That. I, had, I had a question about that. Now, take note, folks. So far, we know that Betty. <laughs> has this desire to dox based on rage. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And based on whatever's happening in her pants so far. Oh. <laughs> so far, this you is know what, what we know. Fuck you, Blair, for saying it like that. Or try to, or want to at least. You oh, did, fuck you for saying it like that. But it's so true. Didn't actually try. There was no way to actually try. Actually. Um, how is it that Somebody who has, for the last couple of live streams, been advocating against going. Watch her face. Watch her face. How angry it gets. Like, the rage comes over her. Every police report. (laughs) Every police report. We're getting a glimpse of what her face looked like prior to. To 911 being called. Real life wants to know who somebody is in real life. Oh no. Can you answer that? I sure can. For your honest, please. Sure can. Don't come on Bullhorn Betty's channel, flatter the hell out of her, and then say, I'm going to be incognito and anonymous. Wow. It's going to make me want to. She's mad right now. Right now, she's like, shit, I just got catfish trolled. <laughs> God knows what else all in one wow. right now. Everybody deserves Peel the their back, right the to layer of the idea. It's going to make me want to look Why behind the curtain. Person their right to Can you answer that? What is the question? Why doesn't every single person that goes on YouTube or any social media platform deserve their right to privacy? It's very simple. You have your right to privacy until you intrude on somebody else's. What? And you know what? If you see my face and you have, and I give you the opportunity so you to conduct that, 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 you're at- Oh. Now, okay. Oh. She's mad as fuck right yeah. now. Yeah. Exactly, Remly. Hmm. Uh, or Remy, sorry. Um, she's mad as fuck. Now, <laughs> she's mad because she's being called. Thank you, isolationist. One dollar. <laughs> Cash app a donation. Please don't play her singing again. <laughs> you got it. Thank you so called much. Called out on something that she already knows is wrong. Otherwise, it wouldn't have made her mad. Because if you notice what she just did, she just she just justified her actions. And when she's when when I said right to privacy. She was like, unless you come on my channel, and then she realizes in her head that what she does on her channel is not private. Once it's out there, it's out there. Right. It's not private. You made it public, Betty. You made it public. Mm -hmm. So therefore, it's no longer private. So therefore, me being that caller, even though I'm joking, and even though I'm saying who I am now, I had my right to privacy, right? She wanted to know who I was. She wanted me on her channel to be like, my name is this, 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 and I live in blah, blah, blah. And I'm going to make a date with you, Betty. That's what. You know, what's so interesting is the, the, just the sense of entitlement that this woman has. That she gets to, in her words, unmask whoever she wants. And no one is allowed to have privacy. But then in other streams, she will scream and yell that somebody has said her first name, even though she says her first name all the time publicly. Like the, just the double standard across the board is insane. I was watching clips of a stream she did within like the last couple of days. 
And after all of the knowledge that we have, where we've seen her protesting in front of people's houses with a bullhorn and threatening other people with the same, she was on this stream a couple of days ago talking about how if anybody ever did that to her, she would call the FBI because that's stalking. Girl, stop it. <laughs> Just stop. But she was, that's what she wanted. It was really fucking weird. And so, <laughs> so here she realizes all of this in one moment. And as much time as it took for me to switch that and switch the table on her and go, why doesn't some, why don't you think somebody deserves their right to privacy? And that is the only way I broke character. So she's still a little confused. She's like, wait a minute. I still I, I still want this guy to be this person <laughs> who got me all hot and bothered at the beginning of this phone call. Asking me a question, you're going to let me finish. You're going to oh. let me finish. I'm just saying. Ooh, we okay. just saw a little glimpse. We just saw a little glimpse, folks. You're going to let me finish. She just got mad, folks. This is how she gets mad. Monique, member for six months. Thank you for making me laugh today. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Johnny Fappleseed, uh, love your name. BHB versus Shani, Mortal Kombat. Yep. I'd love to see that for sure. This is this is uh this is what the police reports are all about. Oh, you can you gonna hey, hush? Mikey, I'm sorry. I'm you sorry. gonna hush I'm up and you're gonna you. let me finish my sentence. You're gonna hush up. If you gonna come on to YouTube, if you want to be anonymous, you can be anonymous, but you do not attack a person viciously. You do not go after a person to take them down. If you have a problem with a person, oh, you're, uh, yeah, are you are, are you interrupting a woman? Oh, now? Betty, I will interrupt you right now because it's exactly what you try to do with Monty and his family. Remember that? Oh, uh, that's still ongoing. Remember that? I, I love how she's trying to act like none of that happened. Again? Oh, so now, now, again, now this wasn't planned. This wasn't exactly planned. I was just using the dominant male thing to create this character, which I, in my head at the time, I knew I was just kind of fucking with her because I know that she goes for like the cuck types just total fucking pussies. Maybe she should go after Rev. Oh, you know what, guys? I got an idea. She should totally date Revelation News. Boom. Got it. So that's what I was trying to do. But now what she's doing is adding a bonus to that, which is she's saying she's basically using the fact that I use the term male dominance to describe myself as a weapon against me and say that I was being abusive towards a woman, that I'm being disrespectful to women because I interrupt what she's saying, even though she just wanted to go on a tangent and not be asked any questions because she is 150% on the defense right now. Mm -hmm. On what you put out there, what if it's based on that? And what I put out there? Quick. Hey, you know what? It's fair game. But when you want to be you anonymous and hide oh, behind, you were if you... Okay, now you just heard her, wow, folks. Wow, okay. Anything that she puts out there is fair game. Really? Right? Thank you so much, Bullhorn Betty. Yet another clip I can use to prove that you don't mind when I review you. Thanks. Did she or did she not just say that? So why is she striking channels? Mm, great question. That's what I'm curious about. Mm. Why is she striking channels? Why is she doxing creators like Hannibal and his family? Why Monty, is she but... doing everything in her power on her free time to find out who Burt Toast is? Mm. But even you just hear her admit that everything that she does and puts out there on her channel is fair game. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's cool. Yeah. It was actually uh, Monty and his family, but yeah, she was going after Hannibal. It, it spilled over to uh, Hannibal and people around him as well. Oh, it, there was a lot that is still going on. 
<clears throat> the glare stole my chicken nugs. Oh, no. Who's your bunny? $5 super chat. Holy LOL cows. <laughs> Imagine the drink, drink streams we'd get from her and Jason. Oh, yes. Yes. I mean, she is kind of his type. Uh, blonde. I don't know if she has any tattoos, but she's definitely the same caliber of IQ that Shani is. And she loves drinking. You know, I mean, she would really be the perfect uh, rebound for Rev. I'm rooting for that. For reals. Rooting for that. Um, so, yeah. Yet she's trying to file lawsuits against people for reviewing her channel. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, 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 right? oh, 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 oh. I just sang for you. Calm down, calm down, baby. Calm down. All right, I'm calm. I'm calm. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, baby. It's just, I love you so much. Now, obviously, I'm just trying to keep her from hanging up on me at this point because I want her to say more. <laughs> and I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get a better understanding, and I want to put these people down. These people. I don't I'm want to put anybody put down. People. You know what I want? I want people to live in harmony. I oh want people, bullshit! This is what I. Uh, now there's always this shit, mm, right? Thank you. I keep hearing this bullshit. I hear it from creators I don't like. I hear it from creators I once liked. I keep hearing this bullshit to justify their bullshit behavior. Yeah. Which is some sort of weird justification for not having any core beliefs and conviction behind them. Thank you. Thank I you. just want everybody to live in a kumbaya, everybody gets along kind of world. That's all I want. I want everybody to live in a in a in a happy world where everybody gets along, but you really don't, do you? You really don't. What you want is for people to see things your way and only your way. And not have any type of negative opinion about you or express it publicly. Be Correct. And it's, it's a big part of it is people pleasing. They care more about what other people think of them than having integrity. And that's, I completely agree with what he just said. Uh, Nick Bordenine in Super Chat. I'm at work, just came by to show love. Blame drag, send money for the hamster is ready to be milked. Yes. Have a great night at, at work, Nick. You're doing something that Rev and Shani don't do. Because you are worried about your own public image and only worried about your own public image. And the irony behind that is people who are that invested in their own public image, we see this all the time. People who are that invested in their own public image ironically do everything that they can to destroy their own public image. Correct. Yep. It's really, really fascinating. Mm -hmm. You want to know what Bullhorn Betty wants? I want people to be comfortable in their own skin. I want. I, I, wow. Wow. Okay. okay. Now she's an advocate for everybody. For if you have, if you're a human being and you have a body, skin, <laughs> it doesn't matter what color, people. It doesn't matter what size. It doesn't matter anything. We just want you to be happy at the Bullhorn Betty channel. That's all we want. People to be able to come out here and be who they are. <laughs> Yeah, and the third person shit. Like, mm -hmm. I, I, <laughs> I can't with that shit. We all know what like, you say about people who use third person all the time. Uh, psychopaths. I can't. I, I <laughs> <laughs> Like, please. Wow. Fucking unsubscribe from me the day that I, like, deliberately and just, you know, I, I just go with it and start referring to myself in a third person. <laughs> Like, yeah, she was like, yeah, exactly, Amanda. She was like, I've got Mexicans in my family. No, you have a cousin who married a Mexican man. And how does it absolve you from the racist shit that has happened on your channel? It doesn't. Glare doesn't do that. Like, I might say shit like we don't do that on the Glare, meaning the channel. But I will never refer to myself as the Glarer. Unless I'm identifying myself on someone's panel. Other than that, I'm Will. Call me Will. That's it, man. Just call me Will. That's my name. The glare is the name of my channel. I can like nothing more 
than anybody and everybody, no matter how they look, no matter how they talk, no matter how they are personally. What was that doing right now? Oh, isn't that funny? Because she's been saying for quite some time, I bet that burnt toast is 600 pounds. I bet she's ugly. I bet she smokes, you know, drugs. I bet she does this. I bet like she's been saying all kinds of shit all this whole time. And now all of a sudden she's like, I don't care what you look like or what you sound like. Okay. Okay. Bullshit. Bullshit. She's trying to make sure that somehow her viewers don't look at her as somebody who is trashing somebody with a Southern accent. Is that what she's doing? Because why is she bringing up how somebody talks? I mean, I'm the one who should get scrutiny for that because I am faking a Southern accent. I mean, <laughs> now she knew I wasn't Dolly. I see people are like, what's that? I mean, that was kind of my impression of Dolly, but not really. It was the same accent. But when I'm trying to sound like Dolly, I, 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 I like to think I do a better job. Uh, but I wasn't actually trying to sound like Dolly. Uh, but definitely the same accent was there. And, and she was, you know, if she thought, like, she knew I wasn't Dolly because I'm of the belief that they speak quite regularly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, BBG372 Bullhorn Betty uh, wants people to be themselves and feel comfortable in their skin unless they're LGBT and then she calls them slurs. Yep. Y'all remember that time where she called uh, Karit AF the F slur? Yeah. Yeah, okay, sure. <laughs> um, Monica, thank you so much. I mean, I'm sorry. Monique. I blame that on Billy, by the way. It's it's Billy's fault that I mispronounced your name. Monique, 499 Super Chat. I'm cracking up toast. <laughs> cool. Uh, yeah, so that's the only part that I wanted to play from this stream because I did want to move on to the Shanny stuff. But I will grab the, um, the link to this stream and put it in. Let's see. I'll put it in the description. But here it is in the chat for you guys. And you can watch the whole thing. Um, it goes on for another like hour and 40 minutes or hour and something like that. It was really, really funny. So I just watched part of that today because I've had a very busy weekend, but that was absolutely hilarious. And I echo what the glare said and, uh, yeah, completely agree with him. AJ Perry. Thank you so much on a scale of one to Shani. How bad is this person? Hmm. Well, she doesn't have children and she doesn't have a partner. So she has no one in the immediate area to abuse, but she has a lot of similarities. Uh, just like Shani, she's been arrested for domestic violence. Um, she's been um, arrested for DUIs. Um, she's been very abusive uh, to her partners just like Shani has. Um, the only difference is, like I said, she doesn't have kids. So there isn't that element uh, the same as with Shani. So we can always blame Billy. Exactly. See y'all, y'all hear me. Yeah. It's always Billy's fault. When I mispronounce a name, blame Billy. Hashtag blame Billy. That's right. Okay. So um, where we left off last week with the Shani saga was in the beginning where they were first sort of showing where the um, the argument came from. This is kind of a continuation of that. And sh the end of the last stream that you saw had this uh, Be Right Back screen, and then that's where I started it. I cut it so we didn't have to sift through it the whole time. Um, when she comes back, uh, this is where she starts going through his phone and it just continues to evolve and it's, it's crazy. So buckle up, buckle up. Are going to go through the pig's fucking phone. <laughs> She's trying to work herself up. So dramatic. Let's see. <laughs> she 
she starts going through his phone. Apparently, there's three phones. She has one, and then he has two, I think. And at one point, they switch phones. So she has his, or one of his, and he has hers. And I'm not sure why they did that, but she's looking through his right now. Oh, look at the splatter marks on her green screen. Oh, I really didn't want to pay attention to that. Oh, you're so right. Oh, that's gross. Oh, yeah, I'm searching things. Like, he has AJ Perry, $5 super chat. Funny how she calls Jason a pig, but is built like the hand demon from Demon Slayer. Oh, y'all got jokes this today. This nasty little fucking dick pic of his. Like, why are you taking a picture of your dick, bro? Oh. Yeah, apparently he sent a dick pic to somebody. Anger is her cardio. <laughs> I mean, at least she does something, right? Something. All right. <laughs> that thing probably looks like a Jackson Pollock under a black light. Oh, you guys are so bad. Thank you, Nick. Remember, he does blame drag later. Hashtag blame drag. Yeah, everything's drag's fault. Because he ain't answering his fucking phone. Nah, he's hiding something. He sent a girl a dick pic. Oh, he got caught. Hi, how are you? Hey, you, I'm good. Good to hear you. Thanks. Where are you from? California. Oh, in PA. Where are you from? Scranton. Okay. Wow. And he sent, wow, you're beautiful. That happened at 523 today. She's just sitting down and she looks like she can barely breathe. Yeah, uh, welcome to Shanny World. This is what Shanny does. She sits there and works up a sweat. Uh, who's your buddy? $5 Super Chat. Did they even know it was a DP pick? They might have just thought it was a pimple. Oh, good point. Very good point. Now, um, I'm sure you guys have heard this on drag streams, but I will reiterate what he said. Apparently, some of them were bots. Some of them were actual uh, sex workers. However, he has no money, and he never actually did anything. It was like he was basically wasting their time and leading them on to think that he wanted something, but nothing actually happened. I mean, I would be kind of upset if my husband was, like, doing that, but at the same time, nothing happened. He was just talking to them. And I, I don't know. I think that obviously her reaction was way out of line. She said he's sending women pictures of his dick. Wow. Wow. Apparently it was a new pick, Kristen. Um, as far as I know, it was a fairly new one. I could be wrong, though. <laughs> yep. Oh, she loves playing the victim. Yes. She will intentionally start a fire just so that she can play the victim. She's done that her whole life. Shani and Rev's free teeth. 
Shani has never cheated except on diets, hygiene, dental health, dot, dot, dot. Ah, you know what? You got me there. Oh, oh boy. Donald Duck, y'all grab your Bibles. Oh. Oh, how dare you not answer when she calls. She's big mad. Thank you, late girl. Thank you for the super sticker. Look at that frown, right? Exactly. Where are you at? Where are you at? Oh. Where are you at? She sat up like a meerkat. <laughs> you guys are so funny tonight. Here we go. Violins in the chat. He's not a fucking Christian. He's a fucking fake. He's a fucking fake. She's throwing his Bibles across the street. Oh, this is amazing. She ends up muting. Oh my God, back. guys. <laughs> He's been trying to hire prostitutes? Uh, warning for headphone users. You might want to turn your volume down. Prostitutes! 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 <laughs> Give me the phone. Give me the other phone. Oh. You're out. You're out. You're done. You're done. I'm not going to get an STD because of you. Is that what the money went to, Jason? No. A prostitute? No, you tell me. Why are you doing this to me? No, you come here and you tell me everything. You tell me everything. What you've been doing behind my back. You tell me everything. I'll tell you everything. What have you been doing behind my back? That that was done. Okay, I, I remember doing it now, the chatting. It was just cosplay. It was like I didn't even take it seriously. I didn't. You didn't take it seriously. Did you think maybe your wife would have seen that? No. What she would have thought? They're not no, married. Said, oh, yeah. cosplay, huh? Yeah, you didn't care. You said, I don't care what you do. It's all paranormal. Oh. That's what you said. Give me that phone. That's not your phone anymore. Give me it. Wow. All right. I've been paying for everything in this fucking house. Not true. What do you mean you? It was my Uncle Tom's money. <laughs> was my not okay, okay, okay. Rev, when he is in a situation like this, comes back with the funniest comebacks. I'm going to back it up. Like, he says a couple of things in this one. All right. I've been paying for everything in this fucking house. 
What do you mean you? It was my Uncle Tom's money. Was my and not when he's not giving money, I've been paying for everything. No, you haven't. What? The cell bill? Oh, the internet bill, yeah. If I wasn't with you, you wouldn't be able to even eat. Yeah, that's right. I acknowledge that. So you cheat on me? I didn't cheat That's on cheating, you. Jason. I didn't cheat on you, though. That's cheating. I didn't see anything. But you show them your dick pics? This girl from Marywood? No, that's, that she's gone, dude. No, 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 no. She's gone. What do you mean she's gone? She's gone, dude. She ate around. She ain't around this area. That, uh, that fucking chick left the guy's in her. Oh, so you contacted her? No. To cheat on me? No, I didn't contact huh? her to cheat on you. No, I didn't. No, I didn't, honey. This is over, right? That's what you want. You want it to be over. <laughs> no, I don't want it to be over. Well, you sure do by cheating on me, Jason. I didn't cheat on you at all. I didn't cheat on you. I didn't see anybody. I, had, I did not see anybody, Janet. Yeah, you sure we're looking to find someone no, here I close wasn't. by? Why? I need gas money to see you. No. Oh. That's ridiculous. Okay. And it's jokes. It's all jokes. Dude. You you and PA? It's jokes. I'm telling you, it's jokes, Shannon. Jokes. Jokes. Look at this. Oh, what is this? <laughs> A picture of you? What? <laughs> A picture of what? Wow. What? Wow. What, Shannon? Shannon, what? Jessica Carlos, hi. UQ, 5.23 p.m. Where are you located? Scranton, near Mirrorwood. I'm available for all kind of fun. No kidding. Are you down here for luck? Cool, yes. What's your zip code? I'll eat you out. Oh. Oh, my God. No, you explained this, Jason. No, I was... I was joking. No, 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 no. This does not look like joking, especially when you give him your dick pic. No, I was joking. Jan. Jason. I was joking. Please. Around. I was joking around. You can believe I Viewmont was... Drive Scranton, PA. Yeah. That happened. Maybe right? later, maybe tomorrow, any time. I will get you soonish. I'm ready to fuck fuck Jaeger. Oh. I'll try to get there because I charge a hundred dollars per hour. Yeah. Got no money now. Sorry. Yeah. I was fucking. Give around. me time. Yeah. Show me your asshole. I was fucking. Can't admit. <laughs> Give me time. I was fucking. On around. my way. Yeah, this is this is too much and it's Give me a dress. I don't have lawn. I don't have pics now. I'm here. Hotel parking? Yeah. Jason! Tell me the truth! I didn't do it. It says hotel parking! No, you tell me the truth. Jason. What? Jason. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. I went to Redner trying to get a drink. Jason. What? Nothing Why would you give this stuff to another woman? I'm sorry. No, you come here and be a man. I mean, first of all, you're not married. Okay. Second of all. You dumped him, Shani, while he was in jail for 13 days because you spent the bail money and then you were flirting with some other guy live on Instagram. So, yeah, come on. You face me like a man and you tell me the fucking truth. Okay, I'm telling you I didn't cheat. Nothing happened because she gave me that address and I got scared as fuck. And then you said you were in front of the hotel? It was a lie. It was a lie. I was playing. I was fucking around with the woman. I was just because I've been fucked with so much. I thought, why can't I fuck with somebody else? So I fucked with her. You get what I'm saying? She just wanted a hundred bucks, and it's like you're stupid. Now I know where that money went. Nope, I didn't cheat on you. I swear to cheat, Jesus Christ. To a prostitute. I swear to Jesus Christ, I did not cheat. When on our you. children needed food. Oh, you, you know what, Shani? Shut the fuck up with that. You've been hoarding food and gaining weight while your children are starving. Don't even try to play the innocent victim now. Not cheat on you and no money was spent on anybody. I spent it on food. That's what I spent the money on was food. I have not been to any prostitute. Okay? 
if I don't have that phone, then I won't be able to talk to you. So if I'm leaving, then it's going to be, I'm just not going to talk to you. You don't deserve me. No, you I've don't. never, ever, ever done that to a man. No, yes, she I has. Never, I never deserved you. Yes, she has. You're a very wonderful woman. I've always been completely honest and open with you and completely loyal with you. And um, that would be no. You know what I've gone through with Chris and you do this to me. I literally was fucking with the woman and I feel bad about it now. She kept asking for a hundred dollars and I was fucking around with her. Why would you even talk to a woman like that, Jason? It was stupid. It was dumb. This is why you've been keep disappearing in your car. Nope. I swear to Jesus Christ. I don't Jason, have I don't believe you. Okay, fine. I'm then we have to split up, right? That's it. Right? See, you don't seem too heartbreaking. I am. Here's your buddy, $5 Super Chat. She spent money on cigarettes and a cab when our kids were starving. That is correct. Yep. No, you I, don't see? I'm going to be sleeping in a parking lot. No, you'll be sleeping in some woman's fucking crotch. I promise you. Or a prostitute. I promise you that that's not the case. I never. You never were a virgin with me. Yeah, I was. Mm. Girl, you should Yeah, you were be... washing that car a lot. Mm. Maybe to get the fucking smell of cum out of your fucking car. Oh, for nope. fuck's sake. Not true, honey. I never cheated on you. I didn't do it. And I had no... No, this, this is cheating, Jason. It is? Yeah, this is cheating. How is that cheating? I didn't You're giving it. your dick to another woman! Yeah. You're giving pics of your dick! Yeah. So, when you were having phone sex with Jason while you were still married to Chris, that wasn't cheating? Just wondering... I was just and then trolling. there's another woman that you were trying to get to prostitute to I you. I was trolling. No, you're not, Jason. Yes, I was trolling. I gave him some real details because I was trolling good. I was trolling them, Shannon. Yeah, no. Those are the same things you say to me when you're horny. I'm telling you. Jason, I, come on. I was trolling them. Do you think Jesus is going to actually get let you get away with this if you were in front of him? He'll know. You are in front of him, in fact. Yeah, I feel it. And I'm telling you the truth, that I was trolling them and I never intended on doing it. Oh, but you never told me about it, did you? I should Yeah, you troll people by giving your dick pic. No, that was stupid. I, that was just stupid. Uh, and what about this other girl? What? God. Who's your buddy? Two dollar super chat. Did Rev buy Monty's used Saturn? Mm, maybe. That you gave your dick pic to. I was trolling huh? all of them. Huh? I was trolling them. Anna Cox. Yeah. Wow, beautiful. Really said, like. <laughs> I was trolling them, Channing. Yeah. He was okay. trolling. Trolling. Them. That's why you gave the dick pic. That was just. Is that guy. your dick? Yeah. That's that was, your dick. Yes, yeah, an added yeah. troll. It's added to troll. I was trolling. That's why you said, wow, you're beautiful. Trolling? Yes. You say a lot of stuff when you troll. He's married. Yeah, I am. And I caught him cheating with you. I'm not cheating. I didn't cheat, cheating. <laughs> yeah, best Oh, I'm letting all ever. these women know that you're married. That's cool. That's fine. Yeah. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to completely get rid of your Facebook. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like it anyway. Yeah, I'm sure you don't like it anyways. It's the way how you get your prostitute. I never use a prostitute. Yeah, right. I never use it's, just, it's amazing to me how she gets to do whatever she wants. And there's never any consequences. And if somebody brings it to Jason's attention, it's like, well, I mean, you know, I, I'm a shit husband. So she, you know, uh, she had the right to do that. Or we were broken up. So, I mean, like she can do whatever she wants. And then he does something and she acts like, you know, he killed somebody. Like, it's crazy to me. Fit and curvy member for eight months. Take a shot every time she says dick pic. Yeah, you would be dead. Keep lying, Jason. I didn't. You Keep know. lying. Keep lying. Lord knows. Lord knows. He does. Lord knows. He and does you're a know. piece of shit. I know I am. I'm awful. I you're know. the biggest fucking piece of shits ever, and you don't deserve anyone in your life. 
You don't deserve anyone in your life. Yeah, Cause you, you take all that love that someone gives you all that love and you, you just throw it away. Like it's nothing. I'm sorry. You, you, you just take advantage of my love. <laughs> really dumb to me, wow. No, it's not trolling Jason. And you know, it's not trolling. You were trying to find someone no. and you've been trying to find someone. That's why you've been gone. That's why I can't get a hold of you for one to two hours. Yeah, Jason, I know. My ringer was off. And I'm sorry, I forgot that the ringer was off. So she has this weird thing where when she calls you, if you don't answer right away, you must be cheating. Um, there was a really great interview last night. Her ex-husband, Chris, came on to Drag's channel and answered a lot of questions. It was pretty eye-opening. And there was even things that he said that I didn't, that was like new to me. Like, for instance, apparently she's lost her kids six times, not five, because during the time that they were married, which was like, I think, six years plus or something like that, at, at a time during their marriage, she also lost, lost the kids. I don't know for how long, but CPS did take the kids at one point during their marriage. And it's like, yeah, it's, it's amazing to me how she wants to act like she's some arbiter of morality and then, you know, knowing all the things that we know about her. Because that plings constantly with the new requests and the messenger things, and it's, it's constantly plinging. It's cheating, Jason. Okay. All right. I'll leave, okay? You want me to leave? That's what you want. No, I don't want that. I love you, and I fucked up. For the sake of having some fucking laughs on the internet. That was dumb. It was dumb. It was fucking retarded. And very dumb. Shani, he said the price is in the amount of time for said prices earlier. What? A he did. Is apparently <laughs> put that on your channel. He said it earlier what? in the stream. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They said that. They yeah. I wonder why you would know that shit. Because I was getting friends. And I wonder where that thought. other fucking money went. I was wondering where the other fucking money went. What other money, Shani? I spent money on food. No, you didn't. You yeah, spent did. it on getting your dick waxed when you have a wife at home that could do it for you for free. I did not. Like, am I bad in bed? No. I am not. I bad in bed? Um, yes. Yes, both of you are. I mean, unfortunately, we've seen it. So, thank you, Fit and Curvy. That's the link to uh, the interview with Chris. That was live. So that's current um, as of, you know, last night. Uh, AJ Perry, $5 super chat projection at finest ladies and gentlemen. Shani can do no wrong despite her abuse, cheating, racism, and overall disgusting attitude. That's correct. And I think it was somebody else that I missed up here. Oh, here it is. Don't forget, not a week before this, she was flirting with liquid drag and sending pics. Yep, that's right, Miss Parker. Yeah. She was on the brow. Yeah, right. I don't believe you. Okay. I don't believe you. Would you believe... If you saw what I saw, would you believe me? No. Hello? <laughs> Jake. Who are you? Huh? Who are you? Sounds like a guy. I can't believe you would do this to me. I didn't. I wonder if I that can't guy. I can't believe you would do this to I'm me. I'm telling you, I didn't. I wonder if that guy was um, like a, I don't even know. But that was weird. That I was a guy. I can't believe yeah. you would do this to me. I'm telling you that I didn't meet anyone. I'm telling you, I don't believe you. Okay. All right. I just want to let you know the man is married and I just stole this. Oh, her phone's ringing. Yeah, maybe, Squid. That bedroom probably smells like turtle water. <laughs> oh, my goodness. And then there's that girl up the street. She's nothing. She's just a friend. I know. She's just a nothing. She's just a friend. You only know her from the store. How could she be a friend if she's just nothing? 
I know it from the store, yeah. That's it. I only know her from the store, Channing. That's it. And Robert happened to be the one that lives with her because he's with Crystal. The guy, that guy is with Crystal. That's it. Shani, look under the latest photo of his Facebook. Look at the girl who commented. Yeah, she shouldn't have outed Robert like that. That was fucked up. I'm looking. <laughs> is it worth it, Jason? To troll? No. It was not worth having fun trolling. It wasn't. A big mistake. I had no intention of meeting anybody. Tell me what state you're from. Yeah, they do that all the time. All of them do that. The standard. The American Bible. The American English. One hundred percent offer start now. Candy Johnson. <laughs> you have prostitutes trying to get you in bed with them. Yeah, that's what it is, isn't it? That's what it turned out to be, and I figured that. Oh, out. it turned out to be. So, what did you expect it to be other than that? I trolled them. Wasn't Shani and G Man a thing? No, but she had pro. She has propositioned him multiple times, including, <clears throat> I think, um, at one point during this stream. She even talks about how, hey, G Man, if you make, if you kick Jason out of the house, I will quote. Uh, so fuck your brains out. So, I mean, she, over the years, there's various clips of her making uh, propositions toward G-Man, but G-Man never reciprocates, as as far as I know. No, I'm just chatting, trolling. That's it. I have not met anyone, Shannon, and I had no intention of meeting anyone. Yeah, that's why it says in front of the hotel, huh? Yeah, that was trolling, dude. I was at Redner's Market. Jason, was, come on. You don't think I'm that stupid, do I was, you? When you were talking to me on the phone, I was trolling her at the same fucking time. I was at Redner's Market getting trying to get drinks, Shanny. Oh, yeah. I swear to Jesus Christ. He's right here, Shanny. I feel him. Oh, my goodness. Uh, isolationist, thank you so much for the cash app. Uh, for only Rev would fall for bots. Yes. I'm telling you that I <laughs> didn't do anything like that. I was trying. What's you connect? That's the app for, for the Durango. To connect to the Durango. That's what that is. That's not a dating app. It's to connect to the Durango. I don't believe you. I swear to Jesus Christ, Jenny. And he's right here. I'm telling you the truth. I wasn't with anybody and had no intention to. None. I was trolling. And it's just, it's horrible. Now that I think about it, it's really horrible that I fucking did that at all. So I'm sorry. Like, on every level, I'm sorry about it. Because it was just immature and stupid. Really immature. That's like high school kid shit. I don't believe you. Well, I never met any woman I'm telling you. My dick's always Yeah, you're, you're, your message is so differently, Jason. Well, I'm telling you, I didn't do shit. And no. money disappeared. The same amount that she charged. And you have all these fucking gross women on your channel. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. And that's all the, the, the ads were right. prostitutes. I didn't know this, but now I get it. Yeah, that's why you were willing to, you know, buy, huh? No. Jason, come on. <laughs> God, you look so fucking pathetic right now. Yeah, I know, and I feel horrible. I bet you feel horrible. I feel horrible. Yeah. Ex feel exactly. Yeah. All those gross women, really, Shani? Yeah, at least they're working a job, Shani. Hmm? At least they have a job. I'm a, I'm a reverend. No, I'm not. I'm a reverend. Look at me. I'm a pastor. Look at me. I'm a man of God. What's up, Mandy? I'm falling too. I'm falling. But I... Yeah, I'm falling too, but I don't do that stuff. Well, I didn't cheat on you, though. That's yeah, I... you did. You consider the stuff in the messages cheating. 
that's cheating. I'm telling you, I. Hey, hey, whore. He's married. Why are you trying to check out my man, you fucking whore? Oh, that's a good point in the chat. Uh, she has a long history of suspicion and intense jealousy towards men. Uh, Shannon and Jason. Shannon was Jason's most expensive prostitute. 700K. Wow. That's a good point. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. I trolled hard. Yeah, I'm sure you did. I trolled, I did. I'm sure you did troll really hard. Trolling. Yeah, you trolled her hard. No, I trolled. Yikes. Which means you they, they think something and it's something else. I was just fucking around with you. That's it. Just messing around. I should have done this with you, though. I would have never done that. No. I didn't know this was a thing on Facebook at all. I didn't yeah, but that. you sure went along <laughs> with it. No, I didn't use it. I didn't use it. Who's your buddy? $5 super chat. Yeah, but I bet those ladies can't fit into a medium shirt. Ah, you got me there. I did not. I just trolled. It was stupid. How'd you get interested in him? Exactly. Has he been messaging you and talking to you? Oh, boy. I've not seen a single girl. <laughs> Trolling is the I've new not cheating. Seen a single girl. <laughs> I have not seen a single one. Not. Uh huh. That's where I was. Uh huh. I've given you everything left of me, man. I give you everything of me. I'm sorry. I no, you. man, I should have left your ass in fucking jail and let you fucking rot and put a fucking restraining order on you and press fucking charges on you. That's how you repay me? I'm sorry. I yeah, you should have done that, but you're a shit mom, so you chose him over your kids. And this is what happens. I really am for being stupid. Because it's stupid. What's W-Y-M mean? W-Y-M. W-Y-M. What? Oh, someone's lying. He knows what W-Y-M is. No, what does that mean? What is W-Y-M? Does anyone know what it means? No. What does that mean? I'm just wondering how, how are you, like, what, how do you know him? Why are you interested in him? <laughs> what is I think it was the, the I, ladies. What, pimp. You, what you mean? What you mean? The guy who answered, I'm pretty sure was a pimp. He's married, you whore. They're not married. <laughs> He's very married, you whore. Now you have people telling you to buy cocaine and pot? What are you talking about? <laughs> wow. Seriously, what are you talking about, honey? They really have no, mm, mm, okay. Uh, Chub the Cucumber, thank you so much. I've been known to troll again and again and again, dot, dot, dot. I don't know anything about that. What are you talking about? He's Mary, you whore. I can't believe you told this bitch where you fucking live, dude. I didn't tell anybody oh, really? Know. Hello, handsome. How are you? Thumbs up. Where are you from? Scranton, Pennsylvania. How old are you? Ran a message? Yeah, so. You're looking. So it did that, I think, only once during the stream? Because their internet was kind of terrible at times. They can see on my profile. There you go. 
doesn't matter. He's just my friend one day. We've been together for a very long period of time. What do you mean he's just your friend and you've been together for a very long time? That doesn't make any sense. What do you mean about that? I don't know. Who are you talking to? <laughs> this Mary Mo? A very long time. What? Check the location history on his phone. Yeah, you could do that. Sure. Check it. You should check it. Go yeah. It. Never pick a man over your kids. I was nowhere untoward. I'm telling you. I love him throwing the hooker under the bus. Yeah, that's what he does. I was nowhere on tour. I was at Render's Market. Because, like, let's just be real. Uh, he contacted them. Whether it was trolling or not, he's the one who contacted them. So I don't believe for a second that um, a random uh, prostitute somehow came across his number and started texting him or whatever. I, I don't believe that. That's where I was. Shannon. Yeah, I'm married to him. Say hi, Jason. Hi. <laughs> oh, this is so dysfunctional. Right. No, he's not a reverend. He likes to say that he is, but he's not. He he's just yeah, he's just taking on the title with no substance underneath that. They know. Where's Mary Mo from? I don't know. No, yeah, you do. No, I don't. I don't have a clue where she's from. I don't have a clue where any of these people are from. Girl, tell me what's been going on in the relationship. I need to know. I need to fucking know what he's been doing behind my fucking back, girl. You better fucking tell me. I need to know. I I am a woman who's <laughs> who who is very disabled and he's been uh, really treating me really bad and disappearing and I don't know why he's been. So I was trying to figure out how is she sending this. So I think she's doing voice memos and then sending them that way because I don't think that she's typing all this out. I've been trying to get food and, 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 and small amounts of drinks for us on the little money I have. I've been trying to get hydration for us. We have no money. <laughs> All right, Carlos. Happy birthday, Shannon. Jason looked for the woman. They didn't look for him. Yeah, I agree. Okay. They are all ads from Facebook. They added me. Mm -hmm. They added me. <laughs> I did not add them. Have you been seeing my phone blow up all day? All no, this is this days? is the phone that you like to hide. No. Troll for BT. Ooh, you're going to give uh, Bullhorn Betty a um, nightmare from that. Uh, $2 super chat. I hear she has a new YouTube channel. Yes. Uh, let me see if I can get the link for that. But it was on the other one, too. Was yeah, this is the phone you like to fucking hide, dude. Hide. Hide. For real? Hide. Yes, hide. I just put it in the dresser because I'm afraid you're going to break it on me. It's Bliss Mancy. Hi, how are you? Hi, hello. Where are you from? Scranton, PA here. Yeah, so? Yeah. So what? They know they can know I'm from Scranton, dude. Yeah, you're looking for someone, man. I'm not, Channy. Yeah. I, I am not, Channy. Oh. <laughs> I'm not looking for anyone. You know how many times I've been played by a dude, dude? Fine. I, it's over, but I'm telling hello, you. Hello, how are you doing? Hey, where are you at? Damn Mary. Who's Damn Mary? Damn Mary? I yeah. Don't, I don't know who Damn Mary is. You in PA? This is the link to a channel that she has been using. Um, if you go to the About section, it's a year old, but I think it's an older channel that she revamped. What she's been doing is that she'll go live and then she'll like delete or private things like almost immediately. Thank you, Kira's opinions. Thank you so much. Kyra's opinion. Sorry about that. 
Yeah, I don't know who damn Mary is. I trolled all these people. Don't you get that? I was trolling them. Where you at? I can be there. My girl is mad at me. I'll be there now. Damn, I wish I had some money. I'm at the hospital in Scranton now. Sent two hours ago. Trolling. <laughs> trolling. You're really mad at me, aren't you? Yeah, you are. You're very mad at me. Wow, so instead of going to the hospital to get your fucking meds, you no. decide to look for other women. No, I was getting my meds. Oh, uh, you were getting something, honey. Nope, I went right to the hospital. To be fair, he did actually go to the hospital to get his meds, and then he ended up calling her and saying, if you remember the last room that we did, that it was going to take three hours, and she was mad, and so she told him to come home because she was needing him essentially attached to her leg the entire time. So, I mean, he leaves her sight with five minutes and she loses her shit. Uh, welcome to the dumpster fire. Uh, Kira's opinions. I appreciate that. Uh, do you think this new drama could be for views? Cause they've made the whole skits for views in the past. A uh, good question. Uh, if that's the case, they're failing miserably because this stream along with her entire Twitch channel was taken down at the end of this. So she's definitely not getting paid for that <laughs> and not getting the views for that. Uh, so they really haven't gained anything. The only people that are um, getting views are the people reviewing them, which is why they're so upset. It's why a lot of Lowell's cows get upset is because they can't figure out why the people that review them uh, get more views and make more money than they do. They don't understand to get meds and if it was going to be a three hour we were wait. getting something <laughs> yeah it was a ghost was a just no just no without me in your life yeah. you're not going to be able to get meds you're not going to be able to get no, I any got, food i got that on my own too no you don't understand jason you need me in order to get this stuff because of the kids no i don't yeah you do i don't have any money so i'm on assistance anyway I'm you can you can continue to lie all you want i'm not lying Sure. I'm not lying about anything. Sure, dude. I'm not. I'm not lying about anything. Yeah, that that's pretty bullshit. I mean, if if he were to leave her, he doesn't need her to get his meds. That is not true at all. Yeah, Miss Parker, it was all because of a ghost. I'm telling you everything that happened, which is just stupid messages. That's all that happened. Nothing else happened. I was at the, I did you get my message with the pictures? Quick question. Did you fuck him? Nope. Did you sleep with him? No, nope, nobody. I haven't done that with anyone except you. I think one of them was You're in the only one I've ever slept with in my life, Shannon. I don't believe you. It's the truth. Like I one of them was in California, Shanny. I mean, come on. Like I that's not even possible, so. I don't believe you. The only thing you've been doing lately is eating me out. You haven't been fucking me, which yeah, means you've been giving oh. it to someone else. No, I've been fucking you. Oh, yeah, right. I have been fucking you. So gross. We have been fucking He's right here, honey, so you better fess up. Yeah, He's that. right here, so I better know. I need to know. I need to know for my children. I need to know for my sake. Have you been fucking him? That's the truth. That is the God's honest, Jesus given truth that I haven't done a single thing with a girl except you. That's it. That's the truth. And you've been moving your shit out of the house. Come on, dude. You're going to move up there with God, them. No. With the druggies. They're gone in two days. Did Shanny. Shanny. You calling other people druggies? Really? girl come on come he on. wants me to help him move and he was gonna pay me and stuff yeah right yep he wants me to help him move he needs me bad for that she probably won't tell you the truth shannon probably not but we're gonna find out oh yeah i'm definitely getting tested i got my gyno appointment soon yeah you do yeah I'm you better clean. yeah you're clean. Sure. I'm clean. Sure. I haven't fucked anyone. Sure. So you're clean. Sure. You haven't fucked anyone. What have you been doing? I haven't done anything. You sure have been trying to get prostitutes. 
No, they contacted me. Yeah, that's why you showed them your dick pic. That was stupid trolling. It was trolling with a dick pic because I know some women get pissed off with that and get a dick pic. Uh huh. I'm serious. Yeah. I was trolling. No, you weren't. Come on. Another. How long have they been together? Um, four years, I think. Um, and despite what they say, they are boyfriend and girlfriend. They're not married legally. They're not common law. They're just boyfriend and girlfriend. Their excuse. It's not excuse. Yeah. No, 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 no. You would never give your dick pic to someone unless you mean it. I'm telling you, I didn't. You're full of shit, dude. Okay, fine. She said, hmm, yes. Just yeah. twice. What? How did it happen and where did it happen? Like, what happened? When did this happen? It's not true. When did this happen? Janie, it's not true. That's not true. It's not true. Now, it's, see, she knows she got trolled. And now she's going to say that. This is Mary Mo. Yeah. I'm telling you, it's not true. She said someone needs to tell him that sometimes it takes seven years for some STDs to show up. Wow. Okay. Uh, well, yeah, you could tell him that. Uh, she actually would be the one that I would be worried about because Rev was a virgin when he started a relationship with her. She is all he has ever known in that way. She, however, not so much. So. If there was anyone that I would bet that would be having things show up on a test, it would be her. I'm just saying. Um, who's your buddy? She's going to use this as an excuse if Liquid Drag gave her anything because Rev doesn't know about Liquid Drag. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Did did she actually physically meet up with Liquid Drag? Because it was my my impression that they had just spoken on the phone and then some live streams and some messaging back and forth, you know, off screen. But did they actually meet up? Because if they did, that's, that is very interesting. Yes, twice. It's not true, Shani. Yes, it's exactly, Smalls. True. I don't know who Mary Mo is from any fucking chick that's clinged me on my fucking Facebook. It was constant. These new people came in and it's all prostitutes, it looks like. I didn't do anything with Mary Mo. Now I know where the money's been going. No. Nothing happened with this person, I'm telling you. But I got Not quite one though, but he might want to deny it, but I got a video of us together. Can I see the video of you guys together? I would really like to see the video of you together. <laughs> She's thinking I'm someone else, man. That's not, I have not been with anybody. A video? I'm telling you, that's not me. Whatever you see there is not going to be me because I haven't been with anyone. Jesus Christ. I promise I'm not some weird skank. I just need to make sure that it's him so I can dump his ass. You know, I just need to make sure that it's him so I can dump him and it'll be the end. Because I really, I don't appreciate him doing this to me because I've, I've given my kids up for him. I've, I've given mm. my time up for him. I've uh, that's your fault, bitch, that you gave your kids up for some boyfriend. You did that. Nobody made you do that. You've been bragging all this whole time about how it's such an amazing thing. They get a vacation now that you like, we're joking it like it's CPS summer camp. Like you, you literally said they're on vacation. So no, no, they're your kids, your responsibility. You gave them up and actually you didn't give them up. They took them. Let's just be, let's just be clear with our language here. They took them because she's negligent and abusive. She didn't volunteer them up. I've gotten him out of jail. I've done everything I could for this man. I've gotten him off alcohol. I gave him my whole life just for him to do this to me. I have never met, met Mary Mo. They're lying to you. 
but this is it. This is going to be the one that breaks it up, I think. It's not true, though, honey. I didn't meet anyone. Yeah, exactly. Why is he even talking to these women? He's supposed to be married. She never got him out of jail. She's lying. And she gave him wet brain. <laughs> Danny? Yeah, Q Rev screaming 700,000, right? Danny, do you want me to leave the house? Shanny? Hey. Shanny, do you want me to leave the house with no phone? Okay, I'll just go. See, this is where Rev fucked up. He should have just left. Just left. Just start over. Buddy stayed. It's sad. It's pathetic. No, I want you to stay here and suffer with me. Okay, I'll do that. But she's lying. But you picking up prostitutes now, dude? No, I ain't. I didn't do it. You picking up fucking prostitutes, going to drugs, drug dealers' houses? I didn't pick up any prostitutes. Like, Shan, those people are so trash over there. Um, <clears throat> uh, Shani. Are, are you um, calling somebody else trashy? Really? Wow. Okay. And you're giving time up to me when I just lost my kids for you? You wanted me out of this house. I wanted you to go get your meds. I but instead you went over their house. Probably fucked that chick. Did I see her? It doesn't matter. You can fucking cheat. You, maybe you cheat going low because you don't want me to find out or figure out it. I can't. I don't have any defense. No, you don't have any defense. I, I suggest you start telling the fucking truth. I'm telling you the truth. Oh, bullshit. This bitch is saying you've been together. It's, no, it's a lie. It's a lie. I'm telling you it's a lie. I haven't met with any woman personally. I have not done that. And what's so fucked up about her outing those people down the street, uh, you know why Jason went down there? To buy drugs for Shani. So real rich that now she's trying to out this guy. It's pretty fucked up. Yeah, eating a prostitute out and then eating you, it's disgusting. Why would you eat a prostitute out? That's so gross. It was trolling. No, it wasn't. Next. Next what? What do you want me to say? No man of God would say that to some a, another woman that isn't his wife. I'm not a man of God. I know that. I'm a fallen sinner. And they're not married for the 50 months. Time. Um, not to sound stupid, but what is Brett wet brain? Nope. No stupid questions. Uh, wet brain it occurs when somebody comes off of alcohol too quickly and not under the care of a medical professional. If there's something that happens when your brain is chemically withdrawing from the alcohol and it happens over time. So it's not like, oh, well, I stopped drinking today and then tomorrow I'm, you know, no longer addicted. You know, your chemical dependence and your brain lasts a lot longer even after you stop drinking. So if you are not under the care of a medical professional to help you uh, come down off al alcohol with like medications and things like that. Um, and you don't do that or you do it too quickly, you get what's called wet brain and it basically makes you kind of a vegetable. Uh, you have trouble speaking, you are in and out of consciousness, you can't walk. I mean, we've seen uh, videos of him where he's just kind of laying like a, like a baby on a couch. He can't even sit up straight. It's pretty sad. And unfortunately, um, I don't know if it ever completely goes away. It can cause brain damage. It can cause tics. It can cause seizures. It can cause all kinds of uh, neurological issues. And um, she is the bright person that determined that the best way to get him off of alcohol after he was a raging alcoholic for years and years and years, um, like he was drinking an insane amount of alcohol. 
And she decided that she was going to play doctor and um, make him quit cold turkey, which is what he did. And then he got wet brain. And I don't think that he's ever fully recovered from that. Correct. Uh, a lot of people say that it's permanent brain damage, but I'm not a medical professional. So definitely Google that. But it's very um, like people can die from that. Seriously. And uh, it's it's really sad that she uh, like it's just it's straight up abuse. It's absolutely abuse all because she wanted to play a doctor. It's it's pretty fucked up. I thought it was fun trolling. And I'm sorry. It's dog shit. Send the video. I mean, they charge for videos for prostitutes. So they, they, it's everything, man. It's a business. That means he lied to me. For what? I'd really like to see the video if it's him. If you want to cut yourself out, that's fine. I just, I just want to see his face at least. Or his dick. I can tell if it's his dick or yeah, not. Because he has a very unique dick. What? You know, uh, always think of it that way? <laughs> She's so mad. Look. You always thought of it that way? You're the one sending your dick pic to other women. And you did today. And then you lie to me and say you didn't remember it. I don't remember these things when I do. I need medication so bad. Oh, you need medication. You had a chance to go and get medication. No, I had to wait three hours. Still. Oh, so you can wait over at the drug dealer's house. Hang out a little bit and then go to the doctor. Right? Place. The next place I was going was the hospital. No, 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 no. I said, I don't want you to ever see him again. And you did. Why do you not? He's a drug dealer and he does drugs and I'm trying to get my kids back, you stupid fuck. Then why is he going over there buying you drugs, you stupid fuck? How about that? Nobody. Oh, everyone knows it. Yeah, well, they do now. Yeah, I want everyone to know what you've been doing to me and the kids. I didn't do anything. Didn't do and, and the lack of care in this and like, oh, well, whatever. I... And... I haven't eaten anything, and I'm completely... Dead. I know. Uh, whatever. I sent my dick to someone. I'm sorry. No. But, you know, it's just, it's no big deal. No, it is a big deal. It's no big deal. That isn't cheating. It, no, it is. Um, who has the boys? Uh, CPS has the boys. They've actually been placed together in a foster home, and um, I'm not going to give out too much information, Um for the same reason that drag is not going to, it's, you know, we don't want people like bothering them. But what I do know is that they are adjusting. Um, their foster family is actually very nice and the children are starting to gain weight. So that's all I know. It is. In a way, it is. I'm not fucking dumb. Okay. You fucked another woman behind my back. No, I didn't. I did not. That did not happen, Channy. No woman was fucked with me, with my penis. That did not happen. Unless he still owes me. Who's gonna pay if that if I send you the video? Oh my god, see, it's her fucking another guy. I'm not gonna pay for a video of you fucking my husband. You could be fucking lying just to get money. Yes, correct. Oh wow. <laughs> They're trying to get 50 bucks for a video. That's not me. That sounds like a scam. Well, then give me a fucking screenshot and do some a favor for the for a woman who you fucked her husband, by the way. Never happened. Yeah, CPS is very much aware of this stream. Um, there were... Some people that were saying that they thought the CPS was watching because later in this stream, um, the cops are called. So, and it is rumored that it was CPS who called them for a welfare check. Jason. It never happened. Jason. Jason. 
I fucked up by by having what I thought was trolling. It wasn't me. Jason. That's right. <laughs> oh my god. Yes, honey. Probably Jake. I would imagine so. What, honey? You broke my spirit, man. I love you, and I didn't No, you, you don't me. love me. Men who love their wives wouldn't do this. Men who love their wives wouldn't fucking kick a kid's head and ribs in. You wouldn't be calling me names all the time, wanting to leave my sight, knowing I'm in so much pain. I love you. you would be there for me. But instead, you're more worried about Robert and the fucking whore. That's nothing that happened to her. I bet it did. I bet it did. Did she come on to you before? No. She t she says I'm the guy that's bad news. She says he's bad news. It's like whatever. Yeah, but you'll hang out with another woman without telling your wife. I did. Hang out. Um, if you can't tell, she's super, super insecure. And if you watch that interview with Chris last night, uh, Chris talks about how um, every every little thing would happen and she would flap the handle and accuse him of cheating. Um, he told a story about one night he shows up to work and um, he opens his locker and I guess a brand new employee, it was a woman, who was brand new, uh, she accidentally put her stuff in the wrong locker and it happens to be, it happened to be his locker. And so apparently she found out and accused him of uh, sleeping with her, even though that it was just completely ridiculous. So she has a history of accusing people of things just out of nowhere. I didn't know she was there. I was going to hang out with Robert. Yeah, after telling me you wouldn't. Yeah, I should. Why? Why should I believe anything that's coming out of your mouth right now? You shouldn't, because I fucked up. But I. I was yeah, I want to know. I want to know about the cheating. Like, how far did it actually go? It was the, the phone messages are it. I didn't meet anyone. When I said I your was body language is saying differently. You're saying something and you're shaking your head, dude. Shani. What? Oh, there's the question. Liar's question. <laughs> when you ask them a question Aww. usually people who tell the truth are direct she loves to play um to play psychiatrist it's ridiculous let me get you that interview of chris actually here it is found it so this is the link to the interview that chris did last night this is not an old video this is live last night so there it goes um, hold, um, who's your buddy? Thank you so much. Women who love their children don't withhold food from her kids while she gets larger and larger. Facts. Facts. Don't ask a, answer a question when with a I question. When I left here. Come on, think of an excuse. No, when I left here, mm -hmm. I, I was going to the hospital. I uh -huh. said I'm going to stop off at Rob's because he said he had something for me. Uh huh. And I got it, which was some cigarettes. He gave me a half a pack of cigarettes. Uh huh. Right? And uh -huh. I was going to go to the hospital. You've been lying about money and you've been hoarding shit and you've been lying. I just got this from him. You're lying. When I was Oh, did you ever offer me a cigarette? Do you want one? You can have a cigarette. Here. <laughs> Here. Here you go. There's a cigarette, okay? Notice how she keeps watching the chat. Because that's really all she cares about in this moment is uh, getting views on this stream. And like I said, it's so funny because she lost this stream, lost the money that she made on this, and lost her Twitch channel. So it's gone. Uh, is this current? Yeah. I was like, within the last four or five days. I'm telling you, as far as it went was the phone message. Yeah, he knew the prices on your stream today when no one was talking about sex workers. The prices, yeah, because I yeah. saw it in the messages. I saw it in the messages they sent me. I got hooker after hooker. Facebook contacted me and I accepted them all. <laughs> yeah, right. Mm -hmm. uh, that was dumb. I should have fucking sh shut my Facebook off because I had to do that once before when this all came flooded through. Mm -mm. You know? Jason? Hmm. Yes? What, honey? What? I'm telling you the truth. 
May Jesus Christ strike you dead. Yeah, he wow. would. This lion. He would if I were lying, Jan. Such a great a Christian, right? You know, asking Jesus to strike down people dead. That's just, that's so amazing, Shani. Wow. Jesus Christ strike you dead for this stuff, man. I'm not lying. So, but, but yeah, he could strike me dead for just trolling women. I've been cheated on several times. Yeah, you have. No, she hasn't. And no, no, no. It was this time. You sent a woman your dick. That's mine to look at. Okay. All right. Really? So why did y'all post it on OnlyFans and Pornhub and Twitter and a lot of other places? I'm just saying, like, if it's only for you to look at, why did you put that shit on OnlyFans and try to charge money for it? And then when nobody paid for it, you put it on Pornhub for free. Just saying. Yeah, you're, you're retarded because you got caught? No, because I was having fun with something that was not appropriate to have fun with. That's what. Jason, it's Mary. Nothing changed about you. He said you're easy to convince. Is that true, Ma? <laughs> what? No, not really. I really do need that, like, screenshot of his face, though. So if you could give me that, that would be the least I can do. Or the least you can do for me. You know? I want to know the truth of what he did to me. It's not going to show you anything because there's nothing to show. That's the truth. You're not. She wants you to... She wants you to spend 50 bucks on it. No table. wonder you've been not touching me in bed and holding me in bed and turning to your side in bed. And I felt distant from you. You've been disappearing. Coming home, taking a shower right away. All of that's untrue. <laughs> I haven't been as close to you before because the prison thing really affected me big time. Great point, Hoosier buddy. No one owns anyone else's parts. I don't care how long you've been together. Period. Yep. True. But she doesn't see it that way. Because people like her do not have boundaries. I know he's insulting my intelligence. I'm not a dumb woman. I know what I saw. <laughs> um, all right, girl. Sure. You saw me trolling them in messages, and I never use their shirt. I see a man say he was in front of another woman, uh, in front of a hotel. Yeah, and it was a lie. I wasn't. I'm sure. Ha, I wasn't. I'm sure. I wasn't, honey. I was at Redner's Market. Ta Malakot, 99 Super Chat. Least we forget, she tried to record and sell her amateur porn to Liquid Drag. Without Jason's knowledge or consent, hypocrisy, thy name is Shani. I did not know that. I know she had tried to do that back in 2021 when they still had their OnlyFans, but I did not know she was trying to sell that to Liquid. Wow. Okay, that is way worse than him, quote unquote, trolling online prostitutes. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. Um, who's your buddy? Imagine if this would have been would have turned out to be Jules again. <laughs> that would have been so dang hilarious, right? That would have been hilarious. Yep. Um, he could turn it around on her and say that her channel name could be instigating other people, such as other men, to come and love her. True. But he's an idiot and he's also a cuck. So I think he he doesn't. I was listening to drag last night. I don't remember which stream it was because uh, I missed it live, but I kind of see drag's point when drag was saying that he thinks that Jason likes this in a sort of kind of way. I'm wondering that myself. I'm wondering if somehow Jason actually gets something out of this, uh, her demeaning him and treating him like a, uh, like dirt. I'm starting to wonder if that is something that he enjoys. It's still abusive AF, 
But I'm wondering if that's partly the reason why he doesn't fight back as much. I'm wondering that. Yeah. And you came home with nothing. No, because I didn't have enough money for anything. Yeah, you didn't have enough money for her. Or anything. Yeah. I didn't even have enough money for a two liter or anything. The generic shit. You know how much of a pathetic person you are. Yeah, sure. Okay. I can't really reply to that. Make you sure how much she yeah. He knows nothing happened. Get all vengeance. He wow. knows nothing happened. No, they're not legally married. Nope. They're going to be homeless for a while. Yeah, that's horrible. Enjoy what you get. I think you did all of this on purpose just for me to leave you. No. Yeah. I started getting these prostitutes on Facebook and I trolled them. Huh. You dick pick for me. How would you feel if I did that? I would understand what you're doing. You're creating controversy to get some people on Facebook. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm doing. That's why you send women dick pics, huh? No, that was really wrong. That was horribly wrong. And I don't. You've even... been hoarding money, Rev. I know people who have been sending you donations and you don't share it with Shanny. Look at my PayPal. Look at my PayPal. Look at my Chime. That's all I, I sent him $500. No, they didn't. Yeah, he's saying it's clout chasing. God, it's clout chasing. It is clout chasing. Yeah, they're not legally married. They've never been legally married. Um, when they were in Colorado, they could have been common law, but she refused to sign the papers, and she doesn't have any IDs. And there, they would actually have fights on stream about this, where he would say, "Why don't you just sign the papers?" Um, so that you know you don't have to have Chris's name anymore, because you know Jason would get really upset about that part. And she would say things like, oh, well, when you get your anger in check, I'll sign the papers. So they were never common law there either. And in Pennsylvania, they don't recognize common law. So they're just boyfriend and girlfriend, in spite of the fact they keep repeating that they are more than that. They didn't give me any money. Well, for clout chasing, I'm sure doing a good fucking job at it. Yeah, you're doing well. No, clout chasing whom? Might as well monetize you being a cheater. Okay. No, I don't deserve to be treated like this at all. Am I okay? I am super pissed off. Why does he think it's okay as long as he didn't have sex? It's disgusting. It's, it's not this okay. It's not okay. I don't think it's okay. It was stupid and childish and rude and everything bad you could imagine. Now that I see it from clear eyes. Oh, see it from clear eyes. You couldn't see it from before. <laughs> no. Oh, how could you not see and send in your dick pic from before, Jason? I'm unmedicated and I don't have my, my, my best role. And I Fuck your stupid unmedicated bullshit. What are you talking wow. About? Mental health advocate here, folks. Mental health really? advocate. I do reckless things when I'm not <laughs> medicated. That's why the porn slip ups happen. Because I'm not, I wasn't medicated. I needed meds. He wasn't sent that much on fucking PayPal, dudes. No, thank you. Thank you, Shannon. Neither chime. Look at all my money apps. Every one of them. I don't know where all your money apps are. Well, it's on the other phone. Chime. Okay? Look at the other phone. Chime. That's what I use mainly for banking. There's no 500 nothing. Okay? You saw who gave me money last, Shanny. Shanny, did you see who gave me money last? Do you remember, Shannon? Yeah, he cheated.
AJ Perry, $5 super chat. Want to know something funny? I believe him. I believe that he was actually trying to troll and Shani because I know you're watching and you deserve far worse. Yeah, he should leave her, but he won't. They are so incredibly codependent. It is like probably the most toxic relationship I have ever witnessed in my entire life. Because I'm banned from Cash Rap. What's this number? I don't talk to anybody. Oh, she's calling somebody else. It's a scam number, right? Scam likely. Current counseling emergency. Emergency? Oh, that's the Stranton counseling. Yeah, see. That was a counseling number. It's a time now that I could actually get my meds. <laughs> Three hours after. Hello. You believe she will end up arrested? Yeah, maybe eventually. I mean, knowing her pattern, she will eventually get arrested. Probably him too. Who knows? It's like they can't keep themselves out of trouble. Are you proud of yourself? No, it was childish and dumb. I'm not proud of myself at all. I'm sure you are. I feel like a complete child and idiot. Like a kid from high school or something. Really dumb. That's how I feel. That's correct, Todd. That was a credit counseling emergency number. So people wanting to consolidate debts or deal with debt collection. That's correct. You broke my heart. I know, I'm sorry. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. Because you keep doing this over and over to me, dude. Stupid shit. I know. You keep breaking my heart, dude. Yeah, I know. Yes. Yeah, he does not own the Durango. Uh, there's a huge balance on it. And uh, according to people who got in contact with the dealership, they are not going to be just forgetting this. So, yeah. Uh, he broke her crinkly heart. Oh, that's a good point. That's a good point, Case Walls. I wonder if she is aware that she has possibly broken her kid's heart time and time again. For what? Men fucking sad. Yeah, I don't think she cares. Unfortunately, uh, she doesn't. She's not even aware of it, I don't think. Which is really, really sad. Everything is all about her. Like, she is the textbook malignant narcissist.
just know if you want me to leave the house, I will, man. It looks like you're really excited about leaving the house. Yeah, I mean, my w girl broke up. No. Yeah, right. It's not what you're thinking. I do want to get my meds. Three hours. That's a long time. I know, right? He freaks out when you mention other guys and is doing this behind your back. I know, right? She lost the stream because she called uh, Rev the N-word towards the end. Like, hard ER. Chef deleted three. I don't have the taxi one. I don't know where it is. Uh, the taxi one has to be around. I got it. Okay. He still owed me about 200 What? What do you mean? I love being lied to. I owe you 200 got two new messages from Vanessa. Okay. Wow, Jason. The names don't mean shit. I, I was I know. I was trolling people and I didn't even see their names, dude. I was trolling. Trust me. He might give you the money back. I would make him give you the money. So, I just want to see the proof, honey. Or, <laughs> there's, you know, there's not no money. Get anything if you don't show me the proof. Like, there's there's absolutely no money. They don't have any money. So this idea that she has come up with that, um, or this story that she's trying to spin that somehow he's given these, these women money, that never happened. I tell you what I was going to do, honey? Can I tell you? I was going to hang out at Robert's for a few hours and chill with him and have some cigarettes. Too. It was 8 o'clock at night, Jason. Yeah, I had to wait that long. God, you're so full of shit. There's fewer people at the hospital later. That's the truth. Like, look at all these fucking hoes. That's how many I was clearing, yeah. It's nuts. I don't know <laughs> That's how many I was clearing. I have no idea. Stunning to a woman, huh? That's trolling too? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Jason. It's positive trolling, yeah. Yeah, sure. Sure. <laughs> you got yeah, hookers. I'm telling you, I, did get I got hookers on layaway. <laughs> yeah. All trolling. Pretty sure they don't All work like that. Because the only person I have an eye for is you, period. Oh, yeah, right. That's the truth. Oh, I believe that totally, dude. That's the truth. In reality, it's you, you're the only one. That's the truth, hon. Oh. Them hoes in this house. My husband would never say that. Yeah. I thought my husband would never say that with her. I'm sorry. Man. You're not? This shit. This no, shit. you're not. I'm glad I'm publicly humiliating you right now. You so deserve it. Yeah, I do, because I'm so dumb. You so deserve it. It was very dumb. Is she banned completely or temporarily? Um, the message that comes up at the end of part four says temporary, but I'm not sure how Twitch, I'm not 
as familiar with Twitch as I am with YouTube. Oops, my bad, right? Oh, it's seven, seven days temporary ban? Okay. I guess she's typing the pimp that she keeps trying to call. <laughs> Let's get forward a little bit. He just ruined his whole fucking life. An idiot. Ruining your whole life for some dumbass bitch. I mean, look what he did with you, so. You're welcome, Mountain Vibes. I know there's a lot of people who didn't get to see it because it was taken down while it was still live. Money for so. prostitutes. No, I don't deserve this. I've been a good woman to him. Oh, my God. No. Yeah, a couple times I slugged his ass. Oh, now we're admitting it. So she's admitting to physical violence. Mm. Okay. That's interesting. No, I don't fucking regret doing it at all. Slugging his ass. Doing that to a woman he loves. Wow. I'm telling you, I didn't utilize any services. I didn't spend a penny on any woman. That's the truth. True. That's the picture we took together. You took? Okay. Is it my face? Yeah, behind the green screen. That's my green screen, you idiot. See? See? Come on. What? Stella Jesse? What a bummer. <laughs> Stella Jesse. That's correct. This is the real Shanny. This is the piece of shit monster Shanny that so many people know that she tries to cover up a lot of times. This is the real her. Top volume button and the, and the home button. Top volume and home. No. Correct, Miss Parker. Just let that mask slip. Give that to G-Man. Oh. You can kiss my ass, motherfucker. 
You ain't ever doing that shit to me again. You ain't ever doing this shit to me again. No, it's fucking dumb for you. Oh, look at the booby pics of a woman. I told you I would get shit like that. Yeah, on your photos. What? <laughs> what? Oh. What? Sometimes I hit the screenshot button. She's man. down for fun at affordable prices, Amber Brooks. <laughs> and you took the picture today. <laughs> okay. Miss Parker. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure you'd like that. Thank you. You four. Her Twitch was taken down because she screamed the N-word. But it's just temporary ban. Her last YouTube channel, oh, she's lost so many. Uh, the last one was taken down, I believe, for child abuse, child endangerment, and I think something else. What? A whore with one sexual partner, though. What do you mean a whore with one sexual partner? Me, I only fuck you. You're the only one I fuck. You can't really be a whore. If you're calling her a whore, I mean, yeah, that's technically Affordable prices. <laughs> Profession. Yeah. Yeah, it's good, Miss Parker. Yeah, and you contact her, huh? And the only thing I will say about that is that uh, she lied. She clearly lied to him about her education. Uh, she lied to him and said that she was getting her associate's degree when in reality she was doing the GED program at the uh, community college or junior college or whatever you call it. And she never finished that. So she doesn't have her GED. She only has 11th grade education. So that was the only thing that... Um, he was kind of off about, but I mean, obviously she's, she's lied to him. So, I mean, I don't fault him for that at all. Take your picture. I didn't take the picture, but I, I, I hit the two buttons a lot. That happens a lot to me. Yeah, that's always your fucking excuse. The screenshot button. The, no, I've never said that to you before, but the screenshot button gets hit quite a bit. I have to clear out the screenshot. Fifty percent off Wednesdays. Yep, <laughs> it's a discount. They're so gross. You're just sitting there burping in the background. Did you get the pic of Shani's first husband? Uh, I have act I have seen pictures of him. The only pictures I have of him are his mugshots. So, yeah. You want me to leave for your mental health, honey? Or do you want me? Oh, I know you want to leave. No, I ain't going. No, I'm not taking a phone, so I'm not going to have any way to contact anyone. But that's the issue. Like, you don't want me to have that phone so you can talk to me at least, or you don't want to talk to me? I need to know that. You know what I mean? If you don't want to talk oh, to me. Oh, I'm busy right now doing shit. Okay. That's fine. Yeah, she's definitely, uh, she has a lot of addictions. Obviously, food is one of them. Um, she's very addicted to streaming and to the internet. She streams her entire life, like all of it. 
she puts it all out there. She's a, you know, the typical uh, little cow that just kind of overshares every aspect of her life and then begs people to watch her so that she can make money, but then gets mad when people watch her. It's, it's, it's stupid. It, it's the same thing that Bullhorn Betty does. It's the same thing that all these other people do as well. They, they overshare and then get mad when people have an opinion about it. So. Trying to find out one of you actually say so you're at her hotel. That's right. She's been on YouTube for like a decade. And nothing to show for it. Um, I think this is a good place to stop. I do want to show you guys, um, Doug's, um, mug shot. Let me write down the timestamp so that we don't watch stuff that we already watched. Okay. So I am thinking about going live an extra day this week, uh, cause my schedule is a little lighter this week than normal. So I'm going to try my best to maybe do a daytime stream but I'm not sure which day. I'm definitely streaming on Thursday for sure, but I may do something on Wednesday too. So look out for that. And let me get you, let me show you guys, see if I can get it. Thank you, Miss Parker. Oh, there you go. Ah, Dragon King coming in for the clutch. Let's see. There we go. Um, so this is the, um, father of the boys and the guy who is in and out of prison for meth. This is her first husband. So she definitely has a type <laughs> skinny white guy with glasses seems to be her type. So, yep. So that's Doug. He's not capable of taking care of children. Like I said, he's a meth addict now. So I'm pretty sure he doesn't still look like this. This was quite an old photo. Yeah. So um, Doug is the boy's father's right. Yep. Doug is the father of the boys. Correct. Chris is not the father, but he did uh, care for them. Um, probably more so as a father than any other man ever did. And according to the grandparents, uh, the boys loved Chris. And she isolated that relationship when her and Chris split up. So that was also very abusive. Yeah, so... Anyway, guys, um, yeah, this was a much longer stream than I normally do, but I appreciate you guys sticking around. Uh, this is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Um, the boys loved Chris and Chris loved the boys. Yeah. Um, I think um, Chris was probably the only father figure they've probably ever known. So... And that's what's really sad, is that she fucked up a really good thing um, by cheating on him and ending that. So that, that was pretty fucked up. So let me get you that link one more time. This is the interview that Chris did last night on Drag's channel. There are people from the audience. There you go. People from the audience was actually asking him questions. It was very interesting. Very, very interesting especially in light of her now losing the kids now for what the sixth time. Uh, 
you know, it was interesting to hear his take on all that. So anyway, guys, I will play you out with a song and I hope you guys have a great night and um, I'll see you in the next one. Later. Well, oh my God, it's like <laughs> money. Ah, uh, folks. You know what this means, folks. Yeah. I'm glad I didn't light that cigarette, folks. Yeah. Right up, church, man. Yeah. A lot of people in the know like us. Yeah. What's the season after winter? Money, 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 money. I want money. She wants money. Money, money. You people are making money off of us. Money. I want money. She wants money. Money, money. If I'm gonna appear in videos for entertainment, I want money. Folks, I want money. She wants money. Money, money. You people are making money off of us. Oh, oh my god, it's like... <laughs> if I'm gonna be your fucking Brad Pitt, I want a paycheck. Money. Like, holy shit. You got that? <laughs> what? Yeah, money. If I'm gonna be your entertainment, I want a fucking paycheck. Anyway, back to the back to the story. Blood Dracul, Dracul blood. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, that Dracul. <laughs> oh my God. Money. They pay they bread, 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 bread. Good, good fucking money. 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 They pay they bread, 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 bread. Good, good fucking money. 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 <laughs> I want money. Money, money. She wants money. Money, money. You people are making money off of us, folks. I want money. Money, money. She wants money. Money, money. If I'm gonna appear in videos for entertainment, I want money, folks. I want money. Money. She wants money. Money, money, money. You people are making money off of us. Uh. Well, oh my God. It's like. <laughs> Uh, what else can I say? Oh yeah. <laughs>